Our problem says I have 12 crayons. This box only holds 10. How many will be left over? Let's go ahead and we'll fill our box of crayons, but only 10 can go in. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now yeah, that box is pretty full. Well, how many crayons were left over? One, two. We had two crayons left over. Today what we're going to be focusing in on is reading, writing, and showing two-digit numbers as groups of 10 and leftover ones. So if we take a look here, we're going to circle groups of 10 and then we'll be able to write the number. So let me go ahead and use my pen tool. So let's circle groups of 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Oh, interesting. I noticed that this is 5 here. That makes me think this might be 5 too. Let's count it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. It is. So I know that 5 and 5 is 10. So I'm going to circle that group of 10. Here's another 5 and another 5. So that will be another group of 10. And here's another group of 10. Again, we know this because 5 plus 5 is 10. So we have 1, 2, 3 three groups of 10 and five left over. So how much is that? Well, it's 10, 20, 30, and five ones. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. So three groups of 10 and five left over is 35. Let's try another. Go ahead and we're going to circle the groups of 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So we have one group of 10. And we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 left over. So 10 and 6 more. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. We could also think of it this way. Well, we know that one group of 10 is 1. And with six ones, it's a 6. And we see that it is 16. OK, let's try this one. Again, we need to circle groups of 10 first. 5, 10. Again, I can count by 5 since so I know there's 5 there. 5, 10. 5, 10. 5, 10. And then there's not enough here to be another group of 10, so I can't circle it. So let's see how many groups of 10s there were. 1, 10, 2, 10, 3, 10s, 4, 10s. There were four groups of 10. You can see that here. How many are left over? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. There were eight left over. So four groups of 10 and eight left over. Well, how much is that? Let's go ahead and we can count it. Let's count the tens. 10, 20, 30, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48. Let's take a look at your practice today. Again, it says for your learning target, I can read, write, and show two digit numbers as groups of 10 and leftover ones. So you're going to circle the groups of 10 and write the number. We're going to do this first one together. So we have, these are in groups of 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So I'm going to circle this. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Notice that these were like individual cubes that were near each other. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. There we go. So I circled the groups of 10. So how many groups of 10 were there? 1, 10, 2, 10, 3. So three groups of 10. How many were left over? 1, 2. So the leftover, 
or sorry, so three groups of 10 and two left over is, well, we can count it, 10, 20, 30, 31, 32. We could also think of it as three tens and two ones, 32. I want to point out when you're doing the ones down here, notice that these one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten are already in a ten. You do not want to circle two of them together because that would be twenty. So make sure you're circling these because they're only you need to circle the groups of ten. And when they are in pictured like this, we know that this is a ten.